viewers in this video we are going to talk about the types of sentence so let's start types of sentence so there are three types of sentence the first one is simple sentence The second one is compound sentence. And the third one is complex sentence. Simple sentence, compound sentence, and complex sentence. So let's explain them one by one. So the first one is simple sentence. So what is a simple sentence? Let's write the definition. A sentence which expresses a single thought is called simple sentence. A sentence which expresses a single thought is called simple sentence. It means that a sentence which has only one idea, it, uh, it conveys one thought, one idea. So that sentence is called simple sentence. For example, he goes to school. In this sentence, you see that here is just one idea. So that is why it is called simple sentence. Another example, Pakistan is a beautiful country so in this sentence you see that here is also one idea one thought so we also call it simple sentence so i hope you got the idea of simple sentence now let's come to the another one so the second one is compound sentence so what is compound sentence let's write the definition a sentence which conveys which conveys more than one thought and consists of consists of two or more coordinate clauses It's called compound sentence. Let's repeat it. A sentence which conveys more than one thought. More than one thought. Okay? As you learned that in the simple sentence we talked about that there will be one idea. But in the compound sentence you see that uh, what do we say here? A sentence which conveys more than one thought. Okay? And consists of two or more uh, coordinate classes. There will be two or more than two coordinate classes. So that sentence will be called a compound sentence. For example, I took tea, but he preferred a cold drink. So here you see there are two clauses. The first one, I took tea. It's a complete idea. And the second one, he preferred a cold drink. That's another complete idea. So two coordinate clauses are mentioned here. So now this sentence is called a compound sentence. 
I hope you got the compound sentence. Let's come to the third one. Now let's talk about the third one sentence, the third one type, you can say. Complex sentence. A complex sentence consists of one main clause, one main clause, okay? And one or more subordinate clauses. Subordinate clause, you must know, as I have mentioned it in my previous video about clause, you can watch that. So, subordinate clause is that clause which does not give complete sense. It cannot stand alone as a sentence. So, let's see. For example, when he saw me, he ran away. In this sentence, there are two clauses. When he saw me. And the another one, he ran away. So, he ran away is a main clause. Because it gives us complete idea. So, we call it main clause. And this one is subordinate clause because it cannot stand alone as a sentence so here is one subordinate clause and one is main clause so that's why this sentence is complex sentence the another one if you take medicine regularly so what will happen you will get well soon so here you see there are two clauses if you take medicine regularly which one clause is this? This is subordinate clause because it does not give us complete idea if the second part is missing. You will get well soon. So this is main clause. So in this sentence you see uh, there is just uh, you see that one is main clause and one is uh, subordinate clause. So that's why this sentence is also complex sentence. The third one example. Since the people were innocent, they chose him their president, which was miserable, or which was a miserable thing. So, you see there the first part of the sentence, since the people were innocent, so it's a subordinate clause. The second part, they chose him their president. This is, uh, you know, you, say, you can say that this is main clause, because it gives complete idea. And the last one, which was miserable or which was a miserable thing, this is also subordinate clause because it doesn't give complete idea. It doesn't clarify our mind. So here you see that in this sentence there are two uh, subordinate clauses and one is main clause. So this is also called complex sentence. So this was all about uh, types of sentence, uh, uh, sample sentence compound sentence and complex sentence. I hope you got it. Thank you so much for watching this video.